The Christian Family Coalition is a human rights and social justice organization. And we believe all people, including people of faith, should live their lives openly, honestly, and with dignity. However, we do have a concern when it comes to the issue of homosexual so-called marriage because it has a real impact on people's lives when you use the force of law to attempt to redefine what has already been established. Our concern with President Obama's announcement is that it just gives fuel to those who are attempting to impose homosexual so-called marriage. And in doing so, they make two arguments. We believe that their arguments are inaccurate. The first one is that they believe that marriage is right. Secondly, they claim that marriage laws are discriminatory. In reality, what we believe these, indi these individuals are doing is that they're fabricating a crisis. Uh, first of all, marriage is not a right. If not, three or more people could get married. That's number one. In fact, the president never said it is a right. He was just expressing his personal view on the matter. Uh, secondly, when it comes to the issue of marriage laws being discriminatory, nothing could be further from the truth. When two individuals go to seek a marriage license, a civil marriage license, there are a set of, of, of objective criteria that apply equally to everyone. First of all, it must be two people. Secondly, they should be adults. They should not be blood related. They cannot be married to anyone at the time that they seek this marriage license. And these individuals must be of the opposite sex, one male, one female. Those are objective criteria. Nobody asks these individuals what their sexual preferences are. People are free to choose and live their lives how they want to. However, what people are not free to do is to attempt to violate other individuals' sincerely held beliefs and conscience. And that is what we see raging really in this debate right now.